In this affiliate marketing tutorial, I will show you how to build a free landing page just like this one using System.io. This landing page here will allow you to build your email list. As you can see, people can opt into your landing page and then you will deliver a training on a free rebrandable thank you page, the one that you can see here. So everything is done for you on this thank you page. All you have to do is import it instantly, make it yours, customize the affiliate links in order to make commissions and of course you will learn what to do exactly on the videos that are on this same thank you page so by the end of this you will have your own landing page just like this one that you will create using system io and you will also use other tools to import and own this thank you page here and you are allowed to use it but before you use it you also uh, can um, modify and customize the affiliate links in order to make commissions in the back end what's up friends amar here and we will start right away by building the landing page using system io so when you create your free system io uh, account and you log in this will be your dashboard there are lots of things that you can do with this amazing tool but today we will just see the this tab here funnels and as a free member you are allowed to create three funnels maximum so i already created one as you can see here viral funnel which is this one here and i will show you how to create the same copy of this landing page so i will create another funnel which is a copy of the first one but let me give you a sneak peek of what this is what this looks like so this is the opt-in page and this is the thank you page on this example we are going to use only the opt-in page the thank you page we will create it elsewhere on another uh, free app as well so now if i want to see this landing page i just click here to see what it looks like and it looks like this and if you want to edit and customize your landing page you click on this button and you will be brought to the builder so you can use this icon to leave the builder and you can use this icon here to edit the page and enter the builder again and as you can see i can customize anything on this landing page page so let's leave the builder right now and what i want actually is create a new one from scratch so you can follow the steps so once you log into your system io account you just come to the tab funnels and then you click on this button here create and with it will allow you to create a brand new funnel and i will call this free funnel number two like this and then always choose build an audience when you are trying to build an email list if you want to make a sales page you use this one but in this case we are building a list so we choose build an audience and then you click on create and now the funnel has been created as you can see and this is a squeeze page and this is the thank you page and as i mentioned earlier we will be using only the squeeze page for this example so many templates uh, that you can use here uh, lots of them are uh, very good and if you want to like preview one of them you just click on the preview button and you will see how it will look like later like this one for example it will look like this but the template i used for my example is this one here right here so let's just click preview to see how it will look like we will of course make it look like this one here or you can i mean customize it as you wish so i'm going to close this preview and get back to system io and i will select this very template here 
so we have to give this page a name so I'm going to call it F affiliate marketing and also we have to give it like a um, a page URL my account on system.io is uh, https easy dot system dot io and we have to add a word here so let me call it viral and then two like this so the link to this page will be this one here and then of course i can go ahead and start editing the page by clicking on this button here so now I'll be on the builder and I want to get rid of few things and grab other things from this ready-made page and put them in this new page. So let's just start by deleting what we don't need like this one here. The horizontal line also needs to go away and also this one. So every time you approach an object you have this menu here that duplicate settings save and delete so this one i can use it for the big headline but i want to use something else i want to use actually a text box so i'm going to remove this one like this and then i will grab a text box from the left hand side here i don't want to use a headline because i can't like um, customize it like i wish but i will i will use just regular text and put it here on top so next i will just grab this big headline here i will copy it from here and then i will put it right here I will paste it here and then I can make it bigger and I can change the colors so if I select the text here I have here font size so let me make it bigger like this and then I want actually to change the font so I'm going to select the fonts here font type I select Google fonts and I will go ahead and search for the one I want to use is right here patua one so this is the font i used earlier and i can also change the color of the text so you just select the part you want to change the color to and you choose your colors so like this i put red and here i can put the blue color to match the sky behind the um, the page so here are the colors i can click save changes every time i do something and i can preview the page by clicking on the eye here so i don't don't worry about this uh, yellow bar here you can just click the x and it will go away so right now my page looks like this now let's go back to the builder and we want to put the um the the text that is here the bullet points that are here what i want to do is actually remove everything here so i'm going to grab the bullet points from here and put it right there now i'm going to copy my text from this page here i will just copy the bullet points and then come to system io builder again and then i will select all these and paste my text here you can of course control the font size like this i think it's good like this you can change the color of each line you want and then we will um, put an image here and now i'm going to change the image all i have to do is uh, hover over it and then click on the settings button here and then here it will tell you image file so click on this button here i already have it in my images here but if you don't have it you just click upload and then select the file from your computer and put it there so i'm going to go to my images select the image i want actually it's this one here and then click insert so here i have the image i save the changes click on preview to see how it is now and then you can of course make this one bigger or make this one a little bit smaller so what i'm going to do is go back to the builder i want to select this headline here and give it some 
padding and merging so it will um, stay a little bit away from the bullet points so I'm going to go here to the bottom and then push it a little bit to the bottom now I'm going to change the size of this image I click on the settings here and then bring the size of the image a little bit smaller and then click on mm, the middle and then as you can see here on top it has a margin I will remove it so it will go a little bit uh, up and this one here I want actually to click on the settings and check the margins it has so everything is good here on the left hand side it's good and as we said you can change the colors of the bullet points here it's a blue but you can change it here to something else I will keep it blue I will just um, get a little bit the size of the text bigger so I'm going to go up font size and then I will keep it like this save it and then I want to preview and here is how it looks like now now as you can see on the original landing page there is this image here which is the shadow I'm going to add it underneath the headline so I'm going to grab the image uh, object here and then drag and drop until this place here when it becomes blue I have also that image on my images if not you can upload it to your from your computer so I'm going to select it and then click insert so I have it right here I can check the padding or the merging everything is good and now what I want to do is get rid of this button here to bring my opt-in form so I click on delete I have actually a small text here that I will bring before adding the opt-in form I will grab the text object and put it right here inside and what I want to write there is enter your best email address below to get free instant access copy this text here go back to the builder select everything here and replace it with that phrase so the color now is uh, black but you can turn it to anything you want using this icon here so what I'm going to do next is bring the opt-in form and put it underneath this text here so I'm going to my actually um, get response account um, this is where I put all my lists I'm going to go to forms I already prepared a form and this is the form I prepared so what I want to do is click on this button here and copy the code one second so I copy the code copy and then I will bring it here to the builder on system.io and paste it right here below this text here and if you don't have a get response account which is for me the best autoresponder uh, you can use other free applications that you will discover on the thank you page so let's go ahead and put the opt-in form I want to search on the left hand side for the raw HTML I want to drag and drop this object here and then I want of course to put the code I brought from uh, get response so I click on the settings button here and go where it says edit code here on the left hand side and then I want to paste the code and then save so now I know that the get response uh, opt-in form is right here let's save the changes and preview the page and as you can see when it loads I have now the opt-in form right here but you can bring this opt-in form from any other application that you have like Aweber or something else but you can also create your free email list inside system.io and connect it to this landing page so I will let you play with the design you can 
put other images other headlines just to reflect the delivery which is on this thank you page here so this will allow you to first uh, build your email list using this squeeze page or landing page and second you will deliver a training that might generate affiliate commissions for you if people click on your affiliate link that you will change here and uh, purchase something you will have uh, an affiliate commission so please leave me your questions or uh, anything that you want to know down below in the description box please don't forget to like the video and i will see you on the next one